Now she's making fun of me. No, no. <laughs> Why are you doing that? Why are you Apparently she's like, no, no. no. That's what no, you do. No, no. no. Good afternoon. It's Monday. What's today? I didn't vlog yesterday because I'm terrible. June 8th. You would think. After a couple days, Dana would remember. Nope. I think she's getting older. She doesn't remember much. But um, we were just sitting outside for a little bit uh, before I've got to go to work. It's hot. It's nice. But I've got the next two days off. So I'm happy about that. We had... Um, a pizza on K Bosch keto crust. It's pretty good. Uh, really thin, so I think we over overtopped it. But it is what it is. Um, if I can remember, I'll show you a picture. Oh no, I didn't. Maybe I'll try and see if I can get a picture of it. So here's my lunch. It's on one of the K Bosch uh, pizza crusts. This one's the cauliflower one. Dana just made it for instructions. I've got ragut some seasonings, I don't know what you put on it, mushrooms, tomatoes, some bacon, I don't know if you can see the basil underneath, and then some mutts. I can't wait to try it. Nope, I can't. You want to know why? Because I Instagrammed it, and I don't think I saved it. Fuck me. Anyway, I think tomorrow we might go um, and spend some time with the kids, so you may see us, you may not. We were thinking about going to uh, the house and start cleaning up. I mean, come on now. You know, should have, but haven't done that yet. Just haven't had the time, you know, try to get used to going back to work and, you know, the full-time schedule. So, it'll happen. Don't worry. Hopefully, you'll see Dana later. If not... I've been a very bad vlogger today. And yesterday, actually. But I vlogged the day before. Um... Sorry. We, uh, there we go, it's a little bright. We went to the beach yesterday, went to the beach today, and it was really nice. We needed some time to just kind of like, we needed to get Samantha out of the funk she was in because you know, obviously with the whole quarantine situation, she's been very locked away from her friends and just in general people other than the people that live in this house. So she, you know, she's been missing. She's been missing being with her friends and being just, being a kid, truthfully. So we took her to the beach yesterday. We had a blast. We had a great day. And then we took her to the beach today because it was the perfect weather again. And I mean, why not? You know, our, our main thing in life is to become a leather bag. And this, we're on the road to becoming a leather bag. No, but really, it was a really nice day. We had so much fun with her. And I just think, I feel like we needed it too, truthfully. Cause, I mean, the kids are missing, but we were missing. You know, we've been stuck in the house for quite some time. But anyway, we had a great dinner. Uh, I made, sorry, what did I make today? Fish. I had cod, or I had salmon. I made some mushroom cauli risotto. Um, we had the rest of the spaghetti squash. I'm actually going to make more tomorrow. And, yeah, that's that. It was nice. And we actually just had some enlightened ice cream before. We had the butter pecan one. And um, we had that with, like, a little bit of Cool Whip. And uh, it was good. It was really, really good. So that's that. I'm gonna give Chloe her medicine because she's waiting for it. I know she is. Chloe, you waiting for your medicine? Chloe? She's like, Mom, just give it to me and shut up. Anyway, so I will pick up the camera tomorrow a little more. I was back to work tomorrow and she's off Saturday, Sunday. So she works two days and then off, which is nice. Anyway, so I will talk to you guys mañana. Toodles!
Sizzle. Sizzle. Good afternoon. Yeah, good afternoon. So we went this morning to go bring, um, well, to go pick up Chloe's meds at the vet, which is like 30 minutes away or so. And then we got gas. Arlo went to Acme, got us some Starbucks. Well, that was before the vet. And then um, got the guinea pigs some lettuce and kale and things like that. And then, um, so I don't know if I told you guys this. So we got a quote for a cleanup on our lawn front and back and things like that. And the guy quoted us at fucking $3,700. Ain't nobody paying $4,000 to have their lawn cleaned up and bushes and shit cleaned up. I'm just not. So I told her, forget about that shit. Let me start calling other people. So I called a couple people yesterday and the one got back to us today. And so she said that she was gonna stop by, I gave her the address. She would do the quote and then leave it in the mailbox. So right now we're on our way over there now to go pick up the quote from the mailbox. I'm praying and hoping that it's less than the fucking assholes that we had to pretty much pry it out of them, number one. Because I said to her, like almost a week had passed and I was like, did you hear from this guy yet? He was like all gun ho about it. Oh yeah, I'ma do this for you, I'ma do that for you, I'ma do, I'ma do, I'ma do, I'ma do, I'ma do. I'm like, I never got back to us. So I'm like, we're gonna have to like email them or I'm gonna call. So I called and I told them that we've been waiting. So then finally they emailed that quote over and then after Arlo emailed them back, it was like crickets. crickets again. I'm like, what the fuck, dude? So we got the email for the estimate. I emailed within minutes mm -hmm. and that was Monday. Yeah, that was Monday, today's Today Friday. Friday. So we are, I'm like, fuck them. I'm not paying 4,000. We, we will figure something else out. So I'm glad this person, sorry. I'm glad this person um, called me back. So we're gonna go pick up the quote right now and see uh, how much they're gonna charge us. We do need our gutters, gutters and stuff cleaned and a grading of the yard. But for a basic cleanup, I wanna see what they're willing to charge us. So I'll let you guys know when we get there what that price is. Good Saturday morning. How the hell are you? So, I don't know, it's like 11 something. 11-11, um, make a wish. So I've got, let me show you. This is the Great Low Carb Pasta Company. It's the, um, they're bagels. They're so good. That's the plain one. I've got some egg, pork roll, and a slice of Havarti cheese. I've got some water going on here. And Arlo's making liver. She's having one of the cinnamon bagels. What a combo. Cinnamon bagels, liver, and eggs. So that's her jam today. I'm gonna sit down, enjoy my food, and then I'm gonna go shower, and we have to go and do a couple of things today. And it's a gorgeous day outside. I mean, the humidity is low, the air's off, the windows are open, it's exciting. So that's what's happening. If I remember, I will bring you guys with us. If I remember, I can't bring you in the store because of all the corona situation. There's no way in hell I'm bringing the camera in the store. But I try to, I will try to remember to bring you in the car with us. Hopefully I remember. This is my breakfast. Chicken livers, and then scrambled eggs cooked in the chicken liver stuff, and then a cinnamon bagel with butter. Of course it was toasted. I'm excited. I almost forgot about you. Who is you? Oh, I thought Weezy was locked in the room. Oh, no. No, she would let us know. So, we went to Home Depot. You know, needed to uh, get stuff to start the new house project, but we haven't started yet. Haven't. We're home. Obviously. It entails a little more than we're, we thought. I'm thinking we just had to slap some paint on the cabinets, but obviously Arlo likes to read really into things and make sure things are done right. Dana would have just painted them already. And then in six months, the paint would have been on the floor, but still, <laughs> we would have had that old look. What is it? The worn look? What is it called? Antiquey. It would mean the shit. <laughs> <laughs> I like to prepare and over prepare and then it's like let's just get it fucking done. We well, I can't even say we. 
Dana already ate. I'm still in the process of eating. Why? Because I just eat slow as fuck. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's good though. I'll show you. Ooh, Hold on. Alright, parts of dinner. Uh, flat meat that I don't even know what Dana put on it. Uh, some the, usual, the usual suspects. Red onion, some of the uh, cauliflower mushroom risotto, and then I made a caprese pasta salad. This is the great low carb uh, elbow, elbow pasta. I made a, a simple uh, red wine vinaigrette. There's some cherry tomatoes, some mutts, and then I ribboned up some, um, oh, I almost did not get that out. Ribboned up some uh, basil. It's so you can good. start the story over. Num. <laughs> Num. 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 I wish you could see what this motherfucker looks like right now. She's making fun of me. No, no. Why are you doing that? Why are you saying no, no? No, no. That's why you do. No, no. Rosie, you need to take a shower. I don't know what that means, but um, we were just looking at Instagram. And apparently I couldn't get my words out right. And this one over here, she's fucking making fun of me. Right? Nimne. <laughs> Nimne. I can't. If we can remember to put it here, we'll put it here. If it doesn't work, I'm sorry. That just means you have to go to Instagram and just look at us over there too. See, I almost fucked that one up too. So, uh, I think we're just gonna enjoy the rest of the day and then tomorrow we're gonna try and start in this shit. Ooh, yeah, I gotta go there dirty. Apparently she can't go there clean? Well, because I don't wanna go there clean, sweat, and then come back and take another shower. I mean, how many showers do I take a day? A lot. Apparently she's dirty. Mm-hmm. Very dirty. Show is. Good morning from the backyard with a robe on. In June, it is nice and chilly out. I think it's like 59 degrees. Oof, it's nice. So I just brought Chloe out. Say hi, Chloe. Say hi. She's like, you yeah, know. She just woke up. So we've got some things to do in the house today that we will be doing. And my eye is swollen. Oh, rabbit. Baby one. Um, Chloe didn't see it. Uh, what was I going to say? Oh, we have to clean the cabinets in the kitchen today, in the house. So, being that we have to do that, we have to clean them really good with this stuff that Arlo bought. It's like a degreaser. Even though they're not half bad, they still need to be done. So, that'll happen today. Then that has to dry, like overnight. And then after it dries, we will then prime the cabinets. And then we are going to paint the cabinets. So... That's what we're doing today. It's going to be one of those busy, busy days. I'm thinking about bringing uh, the dog with us only because when you leave her home, she is such a pain in the ass and she just doesn't settle down. But I don't know. I don't know. Like she howls and stuff when we're not home. So I'm not sure what I want to do, but it is absolutely gorgeous out here today. And I think it's only supposed to be like 71 degrees. If it could be like this every day, summer would be a joy, really. Because I'm not into the 90 degree weather. I'm not even into the 85 degree weather. Give me 70s all day, all night. Actually, I prefer 60s at night, maybe even 50s. Anyway, so Chloe's here. Rico's still in the house because I take them out in stages because she'll pee and then I'll go in feed her and then after she eats I'll take him out and then they'll both come back out here so that's what's happening so I have cleaned the guinea pigs cages since the last time I talked to you oops somebody just fell off the top shelf uh, Arlo's gonna make them their salad did you put this on? no not yet you can, you can do it because I've got my uh Bitch, I ain't trying to show your drawers. She's all worried about me showing her drawers. And even if I do, I edit it out. I'm putting that in the microwave for 20 seconds. Um, bright light. 
So I clean the guinea pig's cages. Let me show you once my coffee is done and I can put hers back in there. Um, I just, I needed to be done because Melvin's water bottle is like dripping and it's making the bedding wet. And then, so then his little pineapple he sleeps in got wet and it was just a shit show. And I'm, I'm not gonna only do his. But you ain't gotta worry, I ain't gonna show you. And I'm not gonna do his and then not do theirs, so oh yeah, I don't know. Okay, good morning, Arlo. Good morning, Arlo. She'll blurry anyway. Say hey, hi, Mel. Here he is. <laughs> He's so cute, I love him. Say hi, Mel. Melvin. And then here are the girls. I uh, Arlo's gonna make their little salad that they eat in the morning and that at night. So she's getting that together. Um, we gave them fresh pellets, some yogurt drops, a couple things. Filled up their little log with some hay. Melvin's screaming like a crazy person. Look at him. What do you want from my life? You're gonna eat, calm down, you're making a mess. And every time he stands on the bar, bedding drops to the floor. Melvin, come on, man. Give it a rest, friend. Oh, he's so handsome. <laughs> anyway, we are, I may have a second cup of coffee because sometimes when you have coffee really early, it's like you never had it. So, Austin was up all night, so I probably won't see him till tonight. Uh, he doesn't want breakfast, surprisingly. I don't know why. Let's bring it to you, don't question it. I ain't questioning shit. Um, my eye is a little swollen. It hasn't been like that in like, Probably over a year now, since last summer. I haven't oh, had I little yesterday it was a little um polony, right? Yeah. Something. Like look, look at the look look at the corner of this eye. Oh yeah. I haven't gotten that in over a year. My eyes used to be super duper puffy. And then I it stopped. So I took my allergy meds this morning and uh some Benadryl. We'll see what happens. She's gonna fall asleep. No, I'm not. That's it doesn't really have that effect on me. I don't know why. Um so you're one of those patients that if I drug you with Benadryl, uh, exactly. Yeah. Say good morning, Lou. Good morning, <coughs> Lou. So we have to go to the house today, the new house, and we're going to be cleaning up a storm. So the way you're looking at me now is the way you're going to look at me later. Because if we're cleaning, I'm not trying to. Why am I going to do anything? You know, going to be cleaning. Anywho, uh, and that's all, folks. How many times you get an anywho? I don't know. Do you still have to go to the store? You just said you needed something from there, no? I'm going to wait in the car because I can't go in there. You need hay for the girls. No, we have that. Don't we have in the box? Isn't there another thing of hay in the box? Let me look. All right. I'm not going to take you with me because you're blinking. Are home home. Home home, right. Home home? Is it home or home home? Uh, this is um, uh, home number one. I don't know. Waiting you? room. We're at the waiting room. <laughs> well, it's still home. We made it right here. We did. So it's home. Waiting room. We uh, cleaned up the cabinets. Um, we're waiting for them to dry. Uh, the next time I've got off and we have a chance, um, I'll start priming. Um, we have some yard work to do. I got to edge first and then I'm going to mow and Dana's going to cut a whole bunch of the um, overgrown, like over overgrown uh, weeds and stuff. And then we'll move into the backyard and I'll edge and then mow or she'll mow or she just doesn't edge. Um, in the meantime, can you hear it? I know it's loud as fuck, right? Um, making some espresso so we can have some ice espresso so we have a nice cool beverage while we're working hard or hardly working. It's probably more like hardly working on my end. God, I talk too much. Anyway, we'll see you in a little bit. This is dinner. Two pork chops, some butternut, butternut? That's not butternut squash. <clears throat> spaghetti squash with some butter, a little mm -hmm. salad, 
That's with, where it came from. Yeah, yeah. with um, the creamy Caesar from Ken's. It's our favorite in a bottle dressing. Um, so this is just uh, one Persian cucumber that we split between the two of us. Five uh, cherry tomatoes that we split between the two of us. And some iceberg. And then I've got some LaCroix. And that's it. That's dinner. Looking good, right? Mm -hmm.